All right, the title of this piece for editing is Your First Drift Week. Ooh. All right, let's get this going. Okay. Julian, it's your first drift week. Tell me about it. Oh, man. Is it like what you thought it would be? Is it worse? Is it better? Is it longer? Is it shorter? Is it harder? Is it easier? Just tell me about your first drift week. You know, week. it was all of those. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think, uh, I think it was like... Oh, one second. Julian is a Lone Star Drift driver that's been around driving forever in Texas. He brings out the Slide Life parties with uh, all the alcohol and the cool Airstream trailers and all the different things he's done over the years. We were using his huge tent for years and stuff. So he's been around drifting for a very long time since he was very young. Okay, keep going. Yeah. Do your story. Um, this it's was his first drift week. everything I could have imagined uh, mm -hmm. and, and more. In good ways and bad ways? In good ways and bad ways, yeah. Uh, and, but like... It, it's, it's just like an understanding of like, oh, wow, like we are not, you, like, you see the, this thing online, right? Mm -hmm. And you hear about it from your friends, but until you're in it, you're like, it's, it's really just so your life, like you're, you're a part of it. There's no, there's nothing else. You can't focus on anything else. Like it's just get from place to place and, and, and finish these things, you know, like, uh, I, I don't know. I like it. Would, like anytime my car is broken down, like even today, there's always somebody else that is so much more motivating and motivated that helps me get motivated, and then I'm like back in it. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I don't know. I it, I was so overwhelmed the entire drift week with just meeting people and dri the driving styles, and I, it, it was just like it was fantastic. In the end, uh, I think. I think I got more more uh, seat time than I thought I would, and I could only imagine if my car was working how much <laughs> mo more. <laughs> yeah, because your car broke a bunch. It was down a good amount. Mm -hmm. It was down a good amount. And that's a Z. They it's normally Z. don't break. Well, unfortunately, I uh, not unfortunately. I bought the I traded this car, and it was already a used drift car. So we're, we're just going through all those things still. I haven't drifted enough in Texas to like know everything about it and know how to quickly fix it or know what's wrong with it. So as we're meeting these new factors, you know, like it's kind of, oh, okay, this is what I have to pay attention to on this Z and, and relearning it and, and everything. Um, but it's fine. It's not like I blew a motor, you mm -mm. know? And there were plenty of people, guys rebuilding things inside their motors and and doing engine swaps at the track and I it's kind of like your first drift week starter pack because it's little uh -huh. things you break you're like oh I need a harness oh, yeah. or I need like this fitting that broke like little yeah. things uh-huh that's exactly what it is I needed and that's I, enough work as it is yeah after after we caught fire twice you know or the first time it's like oh I just need to do this a little bit better Not and then the second fire. time yeah the second <laughs> time it's like oh there's a lot more I need to do. And then uh, you kind of just see, like, as, as, I'm ta as I'm taking this car apart and fixing all the things, it's getting better overall, mm -hmm. I think, you know? Uh, and, and we have such a, like, smart array of uh, information with all the people here. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's been pretty awesome just hearing the different insights that they have to say about the Z or awesome. Drift Week and drifting. So everything you're saying right now is kind of vague? Let's get it exact. Okay. So, well, like, what was your favorite a direct part? Question. What is your favorite part of Drift Week so far? The road trips. The driving between locations. Yeah, I've that's not, even I had, better than the actual track time. Well, the track time, I can always come back and get. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't think I'm ever gonna really drive this in between tracks again in that way. <laughs> You're like, it was awful. I'm not gonna do it, but it was my yeah. favorite part. <laughs> You yeah, wouldn't have done like, it unless you were in the middle of packs of drift cars zooming uh -huh. around having fun. Exactly. Like Disneyland status exactly. on the streets. I, I feel like, like yeah, that ga it gave me a reason to want to drive this on the streets, mm -hmm. but like that was that was the coolest thing. I, uh, I, you know, had one one time where I did a little bit of street drifting, and that was my first time ever really, and. That was amazing, and I felt like, you know, the guys, like, you know, like everybody else, street drifting or doing whatever they do. And it's just empowering to be out there with all the drivers. And I think 
I think uh, this the street is just kind of like where you see like, oh, you know what? I'm a little bitch. And like, <laughs> <laughs> like, like anybody going more than 100 miles an hour, it, it is like, I, I've never driven a car more than 120 miles an hour. Like, really? Oh yeah, I'm, I'm and just... And you have like a Ferrari and stuff at your disposal. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You should bring the Ferrari next time. Let's do it. Start, oh, God. start of the next one. <laughs> you would be like, you would be the most uh, crazy person if you brought a Ferrari to this junk. I, I don't mean, do it. don't do it. It wouldn't be that bad. No. <laughs> well, I mean, like, imagine zip tying a Ferrari back together and like looking for wiring harnesses after it catches on well, fire. Well, you know, like my body panels didn't really fall off. The only parts I hit, those were both every every mark on my car was a transition bump. Mm -hmm. So, which was cool because, like, to me, that just means we're mm -hmm. tight tandems uh, for the tandems that I got to do. So, so I ask you these questions because if you tell me the street part and all the mountain driving and the yeah. beautiful locations and everything was the most important part. That tells me I need to come out and pre-drive all the locations we do again uh -huh. and find all the best routes. Some of the times I've spent an entire day re like pre-driving yeah. routes between, you know, a three hour or four hour drive between two cities. I went multiple ways. I, you know, I, I looked around, I studied mm -hmm. maps. So if that's the most important thing to you, I think probably a lot of people enjoyed it and I should go and focus on that. But it does take probably, took me a full week oh, for of sure. pre-driving everything in advance with recommendations from Chelsea. I think Chelsea you need a lot more help. <laughs> Probably, but I mean, I really enjoyed it. It yeah, was really fun. Yeah, but like also on the understanding of and like- I, The problem is like, I, can't, I can't give that task to anybody because whenever I do, I f it fails. But you can give that, but okay, I know you can't, but like you can because like other people have to and it has to be delegated in the sense of like, um, those drives are what makes these dr like drift week, drift week, you know? Like if not, it would just be like, uh, like we would just have our events from like track to track and it wouldn't matter, you know, how people get their cars there. Yeah. But it does matter. And and the rollouts for everybody, for with all their friends, meeting with, seeing, go, pulling up to a, uh, like for example, I was rolling with a group, we've got to a rest stop, we think we're behind, and you, we see a group of guys and- You see eight drift cars blast by. Eight, eight drift cars blast by and eight drift cars were in the rest stop and Matt Kaufman was like just sitting there with his broken- He was probably smoking. No, with his, with his Corvette. No, like the, he, he was driving and one of his- uh, Tie rods came undone. His tie rods came undone. Yeah. And like, we're just hearing like, oh fuck, you're going through this too? <laughs> like, <yeah. laughs> you know, it, it's kind of just like, it, it's it is a level le, leveler. It's it's you know like it's it's the playing field of the understanding. All right, we we all are going through this. Of yeah. course, when we're at the track, respect everybody's driving. Respect mm -hmm. like the distances. Uh, know your level, but like the street part is kind of like you're an animal because like <laughs> that's not what I'm about. You yeah. know. So I, I think like seeing that and being a part of it is like is the magic of Drift Week in in like a nutshell because it has to be like if not then like then then we're just doing an event and yeah so what's the worst part of it um what can i fix or just what's organization the most, what's the organization? so kind of like what you're saying with the you you kind of need help mm -hmm. uh with the um the production set side of it like you know i i think i do a good amount of events mm -hmm. uh large events and the festivals and the production you can always see with new stuff mm -hmm. and that delegation of this person is strictly for this mark well, i don't know what mark does mark is your top guy to me but like yeah so mark what, had what, a purpose and it wasn't really that necessary this time yeah uh i originally had him on the last ones like work on my car and do all that mm. stuff and i have managing but everything was going so slowly the manager shouldn't really do too much yeah but, but they yeah. but they could do they like it's the job so so like we could just like. So your worst part about this trip is Mark. No, 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 no. Uh, no the worst part about this trip is the 
the disorganization. If in, you know me, though, everything is disorganized. Oh, for sure, for sure. I but get like, stuff. I'm highly functional, disorganized person. Yeah, and, and, but that's that's like I guess like the best part about this is like yeah. there's really no. It's not a bad trip. There's nothing. There's nothing bad about. But if you're coming on this trip, you really do want me to be more organized. And oh, I, I, I really do. I, like, yeah. I think like, well, just getting in the mindset of like, all right, there's drift, there's drivers. You know, we have. By the way, delegating. Not to defend myself, but the food is all delegated. The yeah. tires are delegated. Uh, next trip, probably Valino is going to do all the tire changing, all the machines. I'm not going to touch any of that stuff. Yeah. Um, That's fantastic. Right. So I was going to say, there's a lot of delegation going on. And I would love to be able to drive again if I get to be yeah. delegate enough. And um, you can. I, I, I think it's totally possible. I think there's a lot of people that are wanting to help. Mm -hmm. But um, I think more people want to, and, uh, and like, I guess you're kind of going into this. I don't want to be defensive, this. by the way. Keep going. No, no, I guess you're, I, I, don't, I don't mind mean to be abrasive. Be but mean. you're, you're kind of going into this new in Lone Star, but you've ran a company before. Mm -hmm. So just like reestablishing that you kind of have to be a hard ass and like everybody's got to be doing their things, but that is all. And in this understanding and not like just within your employees, but like within the drivers too. And, and mm -hmm. when we do that, when we, all, when it's all in sync, I think it really, really works. But there is there is a constant flow of people just seem like they don't know what's going on within it, mm -hmm. you know? And and I think... So you would like it planned out like a cruise, like at 6 p.m. you need exactly, to be there, 6, exactly. 7 p.m. Because that's then that's, me, but that's, I that's, that's the difference because, like, you're saying you're selling it to... A, a good amount of people as the vacation, right? This yeah. is this is the vacation, and do you like to be told where to go? But keep going. Oh, for sure. Okay. For sure. If, if I'm if I'm if I'm joining somebody else's thing, mm -hmm. I don't like to be making any decisions. That's a, that's <laughs> why that's why I didn't join an Airbnb group because I didn't feel like the drifters were organized enough to like just like do it. And then whenever I tried. I wasn't organized enough to keep up communicating, you know, because it was so late. So like there you we just I think it should be established how exactly. This is how we're doing things. This is how you, either either you say it or everybody agrees to it could to not take away from like what anybody loves. So people get to still do it, but like if if like there's set ways it's mm -hmm. done then people aren't looking back to the past drift weeks and be like, oh, it was like this, you it was like this. You would have hated the first drift week. <laughs> uh, I'm just saying it's a million times less organized. This well, is me in organization mode, but I'll Yeah, but also it. the first drift I week, know. the first drift week, I think were a lot more people that you're comfortable just hanging out with and talking to and yeah. just like, this was a scatterbrain of a bunch of other scatterbrains, yeah. you know? So I, I think that's the only thing where you're in a realm of not working with people that you're familiar with. Yeah. And that's no, the- No, we're at a new location the, every single time. Exactly. Everything is a scatterbrain. So but we try and react to things quickly. Yeah. But I don't, I'm not sure we're ever going to get uh, super better at that, especially with my personality. Like I'm stitching together seven to eight track days over the course of multiple states yeah. with 40 drivers here that are drifters, which are the most disorganized people mm -hmm. ever mm -hmm. with staff and everything. Um, I could, I could try and get more organized. I think the organization side of my thing would be like better routing for maps to make sure you guys uh -huh. know exactly where you're going for certain drives so that no one gets lost. Because some people got lost on, because there was a landslide in one spot. For sure, That for shut sure. down a road. Um, I gotta and like, my battle. I don't know. I, I think uh, like the achievements were really, really cool. I love the achievements, but the idea of like not knowing what the achievements are or not like people are just doing random shit or random things to just, it's kind of, it's, it's awesome, but like it yeah. would be more awesome if like every, like it was a thing that you could collect and people understood what it is. Oh, that's a good one. That's a bad one. This is, oh, you know, like, idea. you we know, just because announced it, them at each track. Yeah. We because to. like people are putting them on the door as if it's like World War II, like this is what <laughs> I got. But like, 
how, we people would love to con like continue wanting more, but we don't know how to just like get them. You know, because it is we fun. Need to, we need to make sure Fielding knows that. It is it, no, it, it, yeah, and I feel like that's a good point. We should have a little diagram and page it, uh -huh, like a little PDF of them. Uh -huh. thing. I think I don't even think about. I, that. I don't know. I think like just like uh, overall, like that kind of stuff in the organization to where, and it's it's really not like how the events going. It's the logistics of just like keeping everybody in that flow. And like, for example, uh, you could do like updating website. I don't know how easy this would be for you, but like- I can't even check my email during this trip, can for you? For sure, no, 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 <laughs> yeah, no. But like, much. that's why it yeah. goes to the delegation. Of yeah, somebody, that would be a delegated somebody that, thing. But that person could then take on so much because it's like, oh, you do this and this, and you don't need to give a fuck about, so sorry about that's that. That's uh, You don't need to care about what's going on with Drift Week except this. Yeah. That's actually you pretty know? good stuff though, because I could do a lot of that in advance. So uh -huh. Certain things like a lot of the video stuff, I can't necessarily delegate. Um, there's, you know, like we're doing four to five hours of YouTubing a day, mm -hmm. hosting a drift event. I'm trying to drive a little bit. We're hosting parties and stuff. For sure. It's wild. And I kind of have to pick and choose my battles for, you know, what I want to do and how much time we're putting on everything. Oh, yeah. It's a, such a crazy concept. But it is a lot. And, and I think, right, I I think you can make it more. Uh, like, I don't think... I think I paid a good amount, the most I've ever paid for a drift event, mm -hmm. and I thought it was cheap for, at the end, like, looking yeah. back, like, pff, fuck, that was, that was so worth it. You're getting a lot of stuff. That, that you're getting a lot of stuff. You're getting yeah. a lot of uh, opportunities, a lot of help, a lot of, but, like, with that, like, the more you make it a commercial, corporate-y, whatever organization not going to be that and, well like, have you know aaron yeah but like the, exactly so the more you do that the more like people stray away but like it does get better because you pay you start bringing in more money you know like no I, you're right i think like this i is would the like first to pay one that more. did better than yeah i would money. like to pay more in the sense oh of, tell me more sure no. sure <laughs> yeah, but i th i would like to see other people want to do that too and yeah. and get exactly what i want out of it yeah. because i, I think should if, make vip packages if for they you guys. did well you know that's what With, my company does oh that's true i was gonna say i'd we, have someone work on your car you get your own mechanic sure but or like oh, just wow, like a, a, a top idea. two two top tier mechanics that can yeah. like that have a weight like you guys were talking about like uh i don't have any ferrari mechanics well, I don't think it's necessarily about that, but like the quick stuff, the the things that like, like right now I'm dealing with power steering. I didn't drive today because like I changed out my rack, and you know I can do things, but I, I'm not You're a not mechanic. Fast to I'm do not that, fast. Yeah. I don't know exactly how to diagnose. So I would love to be able to go to a guy like or some, put my name on the list, and for sure there's no like. Oh, I got this promise to yeah. this person. This is just the way it That's is. That's a super difficult proposition when all the cars are different. At Power Vehicles, it's easy because almost all the cars are JZX 100s or 90s. Yeah. With, and those are all interchangeable parts. With all the different chassis, you need a Corvette mechanic, a 350Z I th mechanic. I think, I think there's, I mean, of course, we're all still responsible for our own cars. I think, like, th it's just help. Like an, I just need a six pack hand. of extra 350Zs. But sure, I don't. I don't know. Like I, I don't know. Like uh, have like a, a support trailer. Like we yeah, do it, the no, Drift HQ van. The no, like a transport trailer. Like people shouldn't have to be. It was like when I needed a transport, it was scary. Like I had no clue what we were doing. Yeah, everybody, you're on your own. everybody was in there. Yeah, but that kind of like sucks. It did. You know, so you want this to be a safer trip. You know, we've never had a transport rig. Sure, yeah, That's no, not I, what we I know, do. I know that. So you think we should have a transport rig? Mm, I don't think you, you should. I don't. I don't know. I, I, I think that people. That's what I'm talking about. This is the easiest I, 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 trip okay, yeah, so far. Yeah, I think there do should be. You want be, it to get easier, which is fine. I we think can there make should. Yeah, I think there should be a transport rig. So, like, at least, like, however, like, if there's a promise of free, like, you you hire, hire a guy two weeks. That's however long it is and then every event there's three open spots mm -hmm. and those guys don't get to have fun they, it is not a benefit it is not a thing there is it goes to the next place so you can work on your car so mm -hmm. safely and securely without having to stress about like oh i don't have any friends here that have garages because a lot of people don't have just friends everywhere you know mm -hmm. like you're a really cool dude but like 
That's interesting. It's, it's yeah, like some people just are this not. This is a dangerous trip. As, it is, yeah. No, it yeah. is. But like, but you've made it this far. Yeah, yeah, for sure. But I would like. That's what I'm saying. So you'd like it to I, be less scary. I would like. You uh, need an adult. You need somebody to hold. I don't need an adult. That's trailer. why I did it on my own. And like, <laughs> I'm I'm totally capable of Ubering everywhere. And yeah. I found I got to know the one taxi driver in that town. And and, and villains town. Oh, oh yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> and and we called him. And like by by the end of the night, I was like, hey man, I'm still out here. Can you bring me a pizza? Nowhere will deliver. I'll pay you the same amount. Really? And, and he brought me out a pizza. You know, wow. like, but like. I'm, I'm, I think I'm resourceful. No, you are. Uh, I don't You're think- You're resourceful I and you have resources and stuff and you made it work, but it was a bit discomforting because like, imagine having brain- Because I'm in a, a new uh, area I don't know. Yeah, no, this is a crazy trip. This is, that's what I asked too. I asked in the driver's meeting, I'm like, should this trip be harder or easier? I was like, this is by far the easiest trip week so far. Yeah. By far the easiest. Yeah. And as we let more people in that aren't professional drifters mm -hmm. or professional YouTubers with huge support, you know, like yeah, when they need course. it and stuff, um, it will get easier to fail and stuff. And I, mm -hmm. I want to make sure that people, there's a balance and stuff, but like, if we were on drift week one, we'd still have one full week of this. Yeah. And we'd have probably another 1,500 miles to go on the street. Mm -hmm. You know, that's actually really yeah. overwhelming. So I've cut it back, we, and you'd like me to make it easier again with the support rig, which um, I could do. If there was well, a few people that you, wanted a you, VIP pass. Uh, yeah, but I don't think it's necessarily a... I, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I don't know if my feelings are just hurt that it, you're saying I need it easier, but like, it's it's more of like... You know like, how I am. I'm a brace. Yeah, I need, <laughs> I, I, need it, I need it to be reasonable. This isn't reasonable how hard it is? Um, not for the amount of money. Right, but you know when you sign up that you're on your own, you have to keep the car running, and that's part of the challenge. I do very unreasonable things. <laughs> but I think as a business, it would be very cool to... Have like, a three-car trailer to transport people. Have to have that security, and I think I think it would be cool to see Lone Star to see you do that stuff that people want. Like, okay, and like, and it doesn't have to be in a way. You don't have to ever take it away. You you can make it. How there about, may be there can be repercussions. It it doesn't have to be a good thing. It's not like how about, a fun thing wait, to like be on the trailer. How about if we change it up a little bit, and we have some people that are a little bit more like that want to pay more. Mm -hmm. And like say Chelsea Denofa rents you guys E36s and they come on a three car trailer and there's three of them and three of you guys do that because you'd like to pay more and just rent a car and have this bespoke experience kind of thing. Yeah. And they come with a mechanic and they come with spare parts and when you break it, it gets worked on and you don't have to use your own car. Mm, because that's too fancy. <laughs> but I'm just saying, that's probably the easier way. That's like a seven or $8,000 trip. It's more than that, probably. Yeah, the 10,000 on okay. a, yeah. So you'd like to be in between. I'd this like to is be... difficult because I have to find a happy medium for each driver because... Well, I think you've got to every... find a happy medium for the type of driver you, types of driver you want, not each driver. Like, it's really important to understand, like, your, your groups. Mm -hmm. You know, like, I kept mentioning run groups, but everybody was freaking out and not necessarily- Why would we have run groups? Not, not run groups, like, groups, uh, not in, in during drifting, run groups for like, hey, at this time, we're all leaving, so you have this pack and yeah. this pack and like this organization and you guys don't leave without each other like it just and it just happens and, it, and it's very easy like you could yeah. and you just tell everybody you like you want your achievement for this beautiful spot like location achievements yeah. and you just get it and thank thanks for coming you guys all roll out have you ever done a poker run no it's kind of like that. I've never gone to a car meet, never done a poker run. Poker, I've like poker or a run, car show. I've been to a poker car run. Meet. It's it's just like keeps people together. Interesting. I, I think. Have you met Aaron? I know. <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I mean, I'm. I, I free was, for all you guys. I was never disappointed. Mm -hmm. I, I like totally had fun in every way. Like even even today, I I feel like I was just so humbled to be here. Like it's. It's magical. It, it, yeah. yeah, it feels like Bob Ross painting everywhere. Mm, it's beautiful. And and like just getting to drive, I drove it like three laps. It was extremely extremely hard. So, but like, I'm leaving my car here and scheduling with Chelsea to know how to drive like this because I want I want to be better. Good. Uh, this this place. He rents cars. You can just use his. 
Yeah, but then I want to migrate the car and then drift week four. And okay. Be just, Keep you going. know, like, so like, I, I, I just think like, uh, You're gonna have to temper your expectations down to Aaron Losey levels, not up to extreme organization levels. I'll try. I'm well, asking you because I want to. I just want to temper your expectations. Yeah, I don't think that I. It's it's. There's an, in no way in my head is yeah. like if I say this, it'll be done. Yeah. I think. No, I, think, I like it though. All right, we are running a little bit long for this interview. Oh man. <laughs> we need to wrap up pretty soon. I like the ideas that you're spitting out. Do you have one more idea for me? Um. Whew. More, uh, just more collaboration. With who? Just this, this the people. Like what people? The like the the drifters. Like I don't. I guess that was like a weird. That was too vague. I I like. Mm. You know what? It's my fault. I didn't come to driver's meeting. I was just thinking everybody's so <laughs> spread out. Like, yeah, like that was yeah, that was me. That was exactly so like. And, but that's but maybe there should be. Re uh, roll the track real quick. I have no idea. I'm not in charge. We're filming something. You We're should, in the middle of an interview. You should do it. It's a once in a lifetime thing. You should do it. I think, uh, I think like just overall, this is the most amazing thing and I'm super honored to be on it. And, All right. and uh, you, that's you, what you I wanted to hear. I don't want to hear yeah, complaints. No, oh I'm man. Keep going. No, I, I, you, no, if we're going to make it better, I need to make it less scary for the kids. Yeah, 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 because I'm I'm not Chelsea. I'm not fielding. I like this isn't my thing. This is my yeah. thing that I'd love to do, but like it's a bit scary. Yeah, it's a lot. Interesting. It's, it's a lot. But it was good. It was good a lot. And good. I Thank love you for it. sharing your emotions and feelings. I'm glad you had fun. I'm sorry it was scary. Um, we'll get uh, no, we're going to have the the drift week floaty pool floaty edition for the guys We'll get you little floaties. I'm not that, sure what floaties That'll be are. my achievement. <laughs> the floaties are the, the three-car trailer. Sure. We'll you have may, follow behind. Yeah, maybe if you need some of that, you get, like, they're, they're, you can just do endless achievements. If you play Pokemon Go, like, or any game, you see that they just m keep making that stuff. Like, yeah. it's just, yeah, they just vomit out, like, rewards for people, and people continue to play. Like, it's, it's crazy. Well, thank you very much. All right. Thank you. I'm glad you had fun. All right. Mike. <laughs>